we're having dinner. I'm at Charlotte's uncle's cabin and it's Friday, Halloween night. This project, so I had to skip Halloween to do the project. Friday night, turning it up, not really. Charlotte's cutting firewood. House is pretty bleak at the moment, but dinner is here. We're just gonna eat some grub and watch some TV, I guess. I'm getting ready to go out in the woods and start my forest mensuration project. I'm starting to flag everything. This equipment is not mine. It's the forestry department of Northland. Flagged everything with this hot pink tape so that if I do lose it, I can easily detect it in the woods. Even the cases I'm flagging, I'm gonna start flagging this Biltmore stick here, my compass for distance and DBH, and my clipboard as well. And the thing people do not, <laughs> flag the most is pencils and that's definitely a key so I'm definitely gonna flag my pencils <laughs> since Charlotte's uncle's cabin his property is 32 acres and I mean everything looks practically the same not gonna lie I've taken precaution now to use this pink flagging tape to mark off every I don't know, 100 feet or so, just to like make sure I know where I'm going. I'm putting it a little bit above DBH so that I can see it through a little bit of the thicket. This is essentially what I'm doing, is I'm taking it, putting it all the way around, and once I have it all the way around, I'm just taking it and I'm gonna be tough. So then the tree looks like this. So sometimes in forestry you have these. The ones that curve pretty much like this. So in forestry, when we take the DBH, we have to be on the upsloping side. I also have to be per perpendicular with the tree. DBH here is 26 centimeters. So this is day two of my project. We're in the Schwamigan Nicolay National Forest. My plot center is the pink flag. I'm doing two plots in Schwamigan Nicolay and two plots on Charlotte's uncle's cabin's property. And we are doing this and Charlotte found this stick that was fused to the tree like i'm gonna move it right now it's not going um we're doing dbh diameter at breast height and we're doing tape for distance in meters height of trees so what you want to do is go 66 feet away and you take this thing called the clinometer it looks at percentage you look right at it with both eyes zero it which means you're at eye level you take the height above the zero, and then you take the height below the zero all the way to the ground. So, see, that's the zero, and you wanna get that and then go up the tree, and so say this one is 80, it's tall, and you go back to zero, and then you measure all the way down to the ground. Now that's just for the total height. For merchantable height, you want to get a foot off the ground and where it ends at eight inches because that's the harvestable wood. So I'm taking actually two measurements of height. This forest looks to be a lot like aspen and a couple old growth, but not very much. We're taking species, bearing, and not looking at regeneration or anything. So we're finished with the Shawamaga Nicolay forest, or my second plot that we just finished flagging i'm gonna come back for coring so we're leaving it there and there was only a couple pines that were here as expected i guess um but the rest of them were oak and aspen but now i'm gonna do the last plot on the property the private property and then i should be done